But Legere said I should take it as a compliment, but I took it as an invitation to fight because I was pissed. Hey y'all, my name is Eva and I'm here with story time. I'm gonna tell y'all about the time that this girl stole my pictures. This just happened to me last weekend. So I moved to Lexington back in 2015 to go to UK. When I got there, I don't know how to do hair, so I had to find somebody to do my hair. And then there's not really many black people that I saw in Kentucky. So it's this one girl I met on campus and I asked her who did her hair and she referred me to one of her roommates. So I started going to her roommate to get my hair done. Past weekend, um, I was gonna do my boyfriend's hair. But we were gonna cut off the back and I was gonna show him the style where you like just have the braids in the front and you know you have like the fade in the back. And I saw that she had done it, I saw like a while ago, she had done it on somebody and I thought it was cute. So I was going to her page to show him. Then I was thinking, I'm like, I haven't seen her post in a while. And so I go to her page and I see that we're not friends no more. And I was like, <laughs> I wonder what I did to get blocked this time, but I wasn't blocked at this point. I just wasn't her friend. So I went to her photos and then I'm scrolling through and I sell makeup brushes. So I'm going through her pictures and I see my picture of my makeup brushes in her photos. And I click on it and it says expanding my business as the caption. And I'm over here like, girl, what? <laughs> and like, I could, like, if it was one of my good pictures where it's like, it could belong to anybody, I wouldn't even care. But this picture, she took a picture that I took of the brushes on my bed. So it's my sheets of the picture I took. And you thought that I wouldn't recognize my picture. And I'm like, that's why you unfriended me. So I got in the comments, you know me. I got in the comments and I said, um, what did I say? So I went on her post of the picture of my makeup brushes and I commented, Left my ass off. You couldn't take your own pictures. This is literally my sheet set where I took my picture of my brushes. And I was so pissed. But I'm like, I really can't be mad because it's my fault. Because I should know better than to have pictures not that are, aren't watermarked. But at this point, I'm like, I'm not really popping like that. So I'm like, I don't feel like people, I'm at a level where people can be stealing my pictures. But I have another story where people are legitimately stealing my pictures everywhere. But anyway, so I went back like a couple hours later to the post because I'm like, so you're not gonna find in my comment like let's argue <laughs> but she <laughs> she had blocked me so I went on my boyfriend's phone and I commented steal my brushes steal my sheets steal my picture if you want to sell something at least be professional enough to use your own resources and you choose the worst picture at that cute arrow and then I went in her messages and I said just because you blocked me doesn't stop them from being my brushes on my sheets you can do much better and then she deleted a picture like the next day but I was, I was pissed about it because I'm like, it's not like somebody I don't know took my pictures. It's like, you know me, you knew it was my picture, you took my picture and unfriended me and posted it like it was yours. And I'm like, that's not cool, that's bad business for you to be a businesswoman. And that Anyway, then that same night I went on Etsy because I sell my brushes on Etsy. And I like to see like where I'm ranked compared to other brushes because I'm trying to be number one. So I go on there and I see a picture, like it was, it was like one of my best pictures though. I saw my picture on somebody else's, um, or somebody else's page and I messaged her and I was like, why is my picture on your brushes when they're not your brushes? I said something like that. And then she messaged me back and she was like, she got her pictures from her supplier from China. And I'm like, so legitimately the Chinese have stole my pictures. So I'm like, I really can't be mad because I should have watermarked and now all my shit is watermarked and I'm not really mad about it no more because I'm like, Eva, that's your own fault. But Legere said I should take it as a compliment, but I took it as an invitation to fight because I was pissed. But anyway, <laughs> if you like hearing people talk shit, then subscribe to my channel for more. Thank you.